Welcome to Fandango's Big Ticket. Mission Impossible Dead Reckoning is our big ticket movie of the week. Which one of the three sequences do you think was the biggest in terms of as a producer and actor? Uh, you know what, each one has been very challenging. Each one was really fun because look, we built the train, the train is real. We had to build the train to put it down a track, to send it off the track. And also what I enjoy is, you know, this, the action that I do with Pong, with Haley, the driving through here, the streets on the cobblestone, one hand, it becomes like you're gonna have, you're gonna be handcuffed. I'm like, oh my gosh, okay. Every morning there was there was a bit of adventure, and also the base jumping that we did. I opened and the parachute opened in a way that threw me into the side of the mountain. I heard you just say you never think it's big enough. Yes. Did you go bigger in this one than in? I I can't tell you. <laughs> I can tell you we went bigger. I shouldn't tell you that. I could tell you, but then I'd have to kill you. Get your tickets now and be sure to check out our full interview on Fandango.com. In theaters this week, a racy and fun Jennifer Lawrence comedy to go along with the latest offering from the very talented Mr. Wes Anderson. It's all coming up this week on Big Ticket. I'm an Uber driver and I don't have a car. Come on up. His parents said if I, quote, date their son, they'd give me a Buick Regal. Opening in theaters is the comedy No Hard Feelings. The number one reason to check this film out isn't just obvious, it's the law, as in J-Law. The actress, who's been known to be pretty funny from time to time, plays a financially strapped Uber driver who answers a Craigslist ad from two parents who, get this, want their introverted son, played by Andrew Barth Feldman, to date a little bit before college. Nice going, mom and dad. And to build on that is the second reason to see this one. It's based on an actual real-life Craigslist ad. Kids, you can go ask your parents what Craigslist is. Plus, No Hard Feelings was directed by Gene Stamitsky, whose comedy chops include working as a writer, director, and co-executive producer over four seasons of The Office. He even directed the episode Michael Scott Paper Company. The car exploded. Come get the girls, I have to stay here with Woodrow. I'm not the chauffeur, I'm the grandfather. Where are you? Asteroid City, Farm Route 6, Mile 75. Also landing in theaters this week is the new film Asteroid City. And look no further than director Wes Anderson for the biggest reason to catch this one with classics like Rushmore, The Royal Tenenbaums, Moonrise Kingdom, and The Grand Budapest Hotel filling out his impressive resume. Has there ever been a more aesthetically pleasing director? I think not. Another reason to watch Asteroid City is the massive list of A-list stars making up the ensemble cast. This includes Jason Schwartzman, Scarlett Johansson, Tom Hanks, Jeffrey Wright, Tilda Swinton, Brian Cranston, Edward Norton, Adrian Brody, Liev Schreiber, Steve Carell, Willem Dafoe, Marco Robbie, Anne and Jeff Goldblum, and more. And if those dozen or so names, plus Mr. Anderson doesn't already have you in the ticket line, picture this premise. A junior stargazer slash space cadet convention which brings together students and parents from across the country for fellowship and scholarship competition is spectacularly disrupted by world-changing events. What does that mean exactly? Who really knows? That's why you gotta go see it. Well, that's it for this week's Big Ticket. Hopefully there will be only good feelings when choosing what to see in theaters. And don't forget, you can get your tickets right now at Fandango.com. Thanks for watching Fandango's Big Ticket. See you next week.